A step-by-step -step ceasefire mechanism in the Donbass will be discussed at a meeting of the Trilateral Contact Group in Minsk today. YATV correspondent Yulia Boshko is there right now. Hello, Yulia. Update us on the latest. Hello, Tonya. All four subgroups of the Trilateral Contact Group in Minsk began working at 11 a.m. Meeting are being held behind closed doors. One of the priority issues of the meeting is the announcement of a grain truce for the time of harvest. Today, the security group was to develop and consider a document with specific protective mechanisms for observing truce in the Donbass from both sides. And on June 5th, the parties agreed to establish a ceasefire regime for seven days and begin the withdrawal of troops in the town of Sanitsa Luhanska. However, on the first day, the militants thwarted this process. The humanitarian subgroup is considering the possibility of the release of illegally detained prisoners of war in Donbass, as well as political prisoners of Kremlin. Lifting of the so-called economic blockade and the lifting of the ban on the importation of goods into the occupied territory, which has been in effect since 2017, is also on the agenda. It also discusses the restoration of water supply, the opening of the latter entry exit checkpoint, and the restoration of a breach in the area of uh, Stanitsa Luhanska. The meeting of the trilateral contact group will begin at any moment. As a reminder, there have been some changes in uh, the composition of the Ukrainian delegation in the trilateral contact group. Ukraine is again represented by the second president of Ukraine, Leonid Kuchma. In October 2018, he announced his uh, resignation. On June 5th, the first meeting with his participation took place. A number of changes have also been made uh, to the composition of and other subgroups. Uh, that's all for now. Back to you, Tonya. Thank you so much, Yulia. That was our correspondent Yulia Boshko in Minsk, where mechanisms for implementing a ceasefire in the Donbass are being discussed at a meeting of the Trilateral Contact Group. Stay tuned with UATV for updates throughout the day.